Wherever I go, Rupert goes. He's in this room now. Would you like to meet him? Try and stop me! This way, dear. Well, it's nothing to be concerned about. What is it? He's going to love you just as much as I do. With no sudden movements. Rupert! It is I! Your brother! Rupert! Oh, he must be taking his morning constitutional. Rupert! Oh, Rupert, my dear boy! <laughs> Have you been in the aquarium again? No. How many times have I told you, Rupert, we do not eat our pets? <laughs> Fish are friends, not food. Meow! <laughs> <laughs> All right, cuddly, cuddly, Rupert. Yes, my dear boy, my brother. <laughs> Why, he's affectionate, isn't he? <laughs> Rupert, this nice lady is Miss Oaks. Hello, Rupert. Mother? No, she's not your mother. But she's going to be your new sister. Miss Oaks and I are getting married, and we're all going to live together in Oklahoma. Not mother. I call her mother if you wish. Keep smiling, he senses fear. Mother! Yes. Mother, mother, mother. Rupert, Rupert, okay, Rupert. Mind your manners. Do you want me to get the collar? No. <laughs> oh dear. Now he's upset you. Oh no! Not at all! Nap time, Rupert! Oh. I'm afraid it's the same old thing every generation or so. The blood will be flowing blue as the dead, when all of a sudden a piece of mad genetic driftwood comes along. So you mean your brother is? Well, you see, my dear, every royal family by its nature has the sort of price that it must pay. Every noble lineage has one loose gene, small as a molecule, flitting round the family pool. It's the sort of one sees in Appalachia, or in the odd inbred Bichon Frise. It really can be such a nasty stain on the escutcheon when a wisp of DNA begins to fray and goes astray. Caligula had the temper, the Habsburgs had the chin, George III went cuckoo bird, and Nero had that violin. Richard, you remember, had the hump and the withered limb. The bushes of Pex were nervous wrecks because their son was dim. <laughs> but look what happened to him. Alas, my dear, our family also carries a bit of a curse. But darling, it could be a great deal worse. Thus ends the curse. Rick's all about sun and soak upon walls, on puppy dogs and decays. All about chocolate bunnies and crazy afternoons <laughs> and daisy chains with a little rub like this. You can't help but have a happy fall with a style upon grace and a smile upon his face. And all that's missing is a crow, a soul, and breaks all about. Pops and Valentine's, that's why people all say, Hey, Rupert, you're really 